Hi guys, Matt here, Man City Van TV. Hope you're all good. It's Wednesday, the 13th of May, and we have some important news. Finally, finally, news on season ticket refunds. Came out today, believe it or not. Um, I had an email around about 10 to 3 this afternoon, uh, which basically just was telling me everything that I needed to know about the season ticket. So what I wanted to do was come and share it with you guys, because some of you might not have even read your emails yet. Some of you might not be season ticket holders, and you might only be match day um, people, and you paid your money for tickets like Real Madrid or Newcastle in the Cup, and you might be thinking, how am I going to get my money back? Thought I'd come and let you know. Well, so let's begin, shall we? Manchester City rolled out this uh, email to everyone at Manchester City, all the fans, around about 10 to 3 this afternoon, as I say, and it said they are going to refund the last six games of the season. Now, it's not obviously the last six games in terms of 50 or 60 quid in terms of um, per game. It's going to be worked out on whatever you've paid. So if you're a season ticket holder, for example, and you paid £500 for your season ticket, there's 19 games in a season, what you do is you get £500, you would divide that by 19 times the answer by 6 and you get the exact amount that will be coming back into your bank account. Um, luckily, City have now said as well, you should receive the money no later than the 19th of June. So that's just a little over a month away, which is um, quite good really, considering they're going to have thousands and thousands to give back. Um, they have been waiting for the government news. They have been waiting for any kind of update from the government and the Premier League. And now obviously it's been confirmed. Games are going to go bit, are going to go ahead, but they're going to go ahead behind closed doors. There's no chance of fans going to be getting in. So City have now decided now is the time to uh, give everyone an update and give everyone the money back. Also, though, you don't have to get your money back if you don't want to do. A second option that City are giving everyone is you can have credit onto your season ticket for next season. There is just one little caveat to that. You must contact the club. So if you want money um, off your season to get the next season, you have got to ring up the club and speak to supporter services or the access team. So just to clarify, if you want to refund, you do absolutely nothing. The money will just be automatically put back into your bank account. If you want to have credit on your season to get the next season, you must get in contact with the club, either at supporter services or with the access team, and they will sort that out for you. So, bit of good news. I've decided personally to get the refund, um, not because I need it, but because I don't know when we're going to play football again. And I think it's better in my bank account because I pay monthly anyway. So, it's either in or there. To me, I don't pay it in one big lump anyway. Um, the second little bit of information is, um, some people may want to know, is car parking. I pay a season ticket for car parks. And what I've decided is, um, there was no information in that email. So I thought, I'm going to have to ring up the club. So I rang up the club itself and spoke to sports services. Um, and I got told by a nice young gentleman who told me that really helpful he was. He was I've got to admit, the staff at City over this... I've been quite helpful this time, really, really helpful, which has been a rarity sometimes because I have spoke to support services. They haven't been as uh, helpful as I probably would have liked them to have been. Um, but today, um, I can't remember the guy's name, but he was really helpful, really nice, sorted me out straight away, so that was good. Um, so car parking, I paid for that as per season. Um, and what they're going to do is they're also going to refund that back as well. Um, so if you pay for car parking, don't worry, that will automatically come back to you as well, which is brilliant. So big thumbs up to Man City here. They've done the right thing. It's took a lot longer than probably anticipated, but at least it's done, which is brilliant. So what more can be said? Man City thumbs up so guys just to recap if you want to refund do absolutely nothing if you want to have credit on your season ticket next year 
contact the club at Sports Services or the Access team. Match day ticket. So for anyone who support who's um, bought a ticket for Real Madrid or anyone who's got a ticket for Newcastle United away in the cup, same process, exactly the same. You will get a refund back into your account. Um, nothing has been said regards to whether it's credit on your account because obviously I don't think you'll have an account for life. You might have a supporter number, um, depends if you're a citizen or not. But as far as I'm aware, it's exactly the same as season tickets, which is really, really good again in Manchester City. So, what do you guys think about that? Have City made the right move? Have they made it a little bit too late? Should more communication have come out beforehand? Um, I'm a little bit... At first, I was a bit, well, why are we not hearing anything? The other clubs had done something. United had done something. I think Arsenal had said something. Chelsea had said something. But City had done nothing. City were waiting on the government update. And that came out, obviously, on Sunday night. Well, if you want to call that an update, it was more of a working out yourself update. But, yeah. But um, City have stuck to the word as soon as the update happened. They stuck to their word and the information came out, which was brilliant. So... Guys, just a little reminder, please stay safe. Just because we're kind of, we're not out of lockdown, even though it feels like we are, we're not. Please stay safe. Look after each other in these tough times. Look after your loved ones. Don't go and see your friends and your family in the houses. That's not allowed. Um, please follow the guidelines. I'm not going to stay, stay alert because I don't agree with it. But yeah, look after yourselves. Mighty Man City fan TV. And as always, up the blues. Take care, guys.